guardrail, please. Hello. How you doing? I need to see your license registration, please. Got a killer in your lap there. <laughs> Where are you guys coming from today? Uh, we're coming from Detroit. I got you. Do you have your insurance card or anything like that? No. <laughs> You're fine. I'll we'll give this back to you. Yeah, it's usually like just a little square card about the size of a credit card. Yeah, I think because I show my card in Uh huh. Okay. I got you. Okay. Okay, no worries. If you can pull that insurance up, just something to show. Uh, is, is it registered to you, sir, the vehicle? Okay. Uh, the reason for the stop is going to be your speed. You have any idea how fast you're going? Yeah, I got you at 97. Sir, what's a good phone number? Traffic. What's up in Detroit? Okay. Okay. No worries. Just ask. Um, unfortunately, 97. That is a little fast for a warning. Okay. That is 27 miles an hour over the posted speed limit. So you are going to receive a citation for that speed. I'll explain how you can take care of it when I come back up to the vehicle, if you will. You guys just stay in the vehicle. We'll get you out of here shortly. Okay. Thank you. License back. All right, so this is that citation I was talking about. On the top, there's a court date listed. You do not have to show up unless you want to. Okay, it's going to be the 28th of this month. Okay, if you don't show up at the date and time listed up top here, that is the date and time that you have to take care of this guy. Okay, all the information to do that is on the back, their website, the mailing address, as well as their phone number. You can go online to the website here and pay the citation. It'll also tell you how much it is when you go on their website. Okay, it's not listed on your citation. If you have any trouble doing that, feel free to give them a call um, at the number listed here during normal business hours and they can point you in the right direction. How give it, uh, so you can't do it today because it's probably going to be at least first of the week, maybe Monday afternoon. Um, I'll upload it uh, before the end of my shift today Then it has to go to the court, but I'm pretty sure that they have to show up, download it from the server, and then it will be online. So give it, give it at least until Monday afternoon and you should be able to pay it then. All right, any other questions? All right, please be careful pulling out for me. Definitely drive safe, and uh, you guys have a safe trip. I'm sorry. Um, so there are points assessed. There are two points assessed for the state of Ohio. Since you do have a uh, Texas driver's license, whether it gets transferred to Texas or not, I'm not positive about that. That'd be something you would have to call Texas's BMV. Um, and if, you know, I know you said you just moved here, so if you... If you end up getting an Ohio license, I don't know if it would then transfer. You know what I'm saying? If it goes to your Texas and then you get an Ohio, I don't know if it'll transfer either. That would be a question for the BMV um, because they're the ones that assess the fines, not the court listed on the uh, citation. All right. Any other questions? All right. Like I said, please be careful pulling out. Definitely slow down. You guys have a safe trip. Have a good one.